Now, your Central Coast forecast from KSBW Weather. Happy sunny Sunday morning. We're looking at uh, Paulo Escrito or from Paulo Escrito down to the valley where things are cold this morning. In fact, we do have a freeze warning in the Salinas Valley as well as the Santa Clara Valley, even cold near the coast. Look at that little pink in the sky there. Embassy Suites Monterey looking over a clear Monterey to start. Clear in Santa Cruz, but also cold. 35 degrees, feeling like 31 degrees. And look at these temperatures. Not only is it cold in the mountains, that of course is to be expected. Uh, 32 at Santa Rita, that's what it was yesterday up at the peak. 33 in Arroyo Seco, 33 in Salinas. 30 degrees at Pajaro, so seeing some very cold and freezing temperatures even at the coast. We're not used to this. Your pets aren't used to it. Your plants aren't used to it, so hopefully you have already taken care of them, but if not, take care of them. Take them inside right now. It's still going to be cold for another couple of hours. Temperatures for today will warm up because of all that sunshine, but it's going to take a while. So even around noon, we'll still be right around 50 degrees, maybe some low 50s by the afternoon, mid to upper 50s. And then we're tracking a few more clouds moving in uh, ahead of a system that could bring us some rainfall. We'll talk about that in a minute. Uh, but Alani mentioned those king tides. High tide today is a little later than yesterday, around 10 o'clock around Moss Landing and the Elkhorn Slough. Uh, those sloughs are typically where we start to see uh, that rising a little more. Today, almost seven feet higher than normal. Uh, and this happens because the moon is closer to the Earth at new moon and full moon this time of year. And the new moon is today. Uh, that's why it's crystal clear out there in the sky. You can see all those stars and also those cold conditions. Across the state, we're within a few degrees of where we were yesterday. Some spots a little colder, some a little warmer, uh, but we're all pretty cold. Three degrees at Lake Tahoe, so single digits once again by this afternoon. Mid-30s, maybe even near freezing for much of the day due to that snowpack and the cold air mass. Cold up north, 44 in Redding. 60s down south, 63 for Los Angeles. And over the next few days, we're tracking this next storm system. So it, it does bring that winter weather advisory to parts of the Sierra and the foothills. You see that yellow? That's a high wind warning as well. So it's going to be very windy, meaning if they have a little snow, could see some not quite blizzard conditions, but very difficult to see. So if you're traveling up uh, basically Tahoe and north of Tahoe, that's where this is going to influence. Uh, looks like areas south of that, Yosemite, looks like you'll be in the clear. Uh, but we'd like to see more snowpack. Looks like we'll get a couple of inches up to um, maybe a foot in some of those higher spots with this. And then locally, we're going to be on the south end of it. We could get some showers on Monday into Tuesday. Starting to hint at something Wednesday. I think we'll just get clouds from that perhaps. High pressure dominating for uh, much of the week. But then we're going to start to see another system coming for perhaps Friday. This one could come as far south as the Central Coast. You can see that moisture a little farther south than us. So hopefully we get a little more rain from that. But rain chances are looking pretty slim, especially in the southern portions of our region. Uh, you have a slightly better chance with that Friday, perhaps into Saturday. Uh, but that's something we're going to be watching over the next few days. Nothing looks too promising uh, yet. Temperatures for today, 50s if you're headed up to the Bay Area, some upper 50s around San Jose, and then you can see 54 for San Francisco to Half Moon Bay, mid 50s to upper 50s up in the Santa Cruz Mountains as well, uh, 58 possible for Capitola. So uh, as we do see sunshine, we are going to see those temperatures warming up just a bit. Aromas, San Juan Batista near 60 degrees, 59 for Salinas, upper 50s down the Salinas Valley. Mid 50s to near 60 around Monterey. And then you can see temperatures over the next few days do get a little bit warmer, uh, but it's still going to be below average for the most part. We'll start to get near average for Wednesday, Thursday, but uh, it's been a pretty cold winter to start. Uh, mm -hmm. Most of December, cold and rainy. Now we're just cold, no rain. So at least <laughs> we'll warm up a little bit, uh, which will be really nice for us and the plants. It's so green out there. We're starting it to see is. some wildflowers already. Oh, it's so exciting. It's so nice. Like all the drives are so much better now. They're down 68. so pretty. A little yeah. distracting. Keep your eyes on the road. Yeah. I'm telling myself that because I'm like, ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, that's <laughs> green right now. Yes. But, all right, Gina, thank you. Mm -hmm.